sunglasses, safety and also here um, this is gonna be a little bit of a how do you say, low energy video because I'm not too happy now right now uh, and you might know this like I'm here alone there is no uh, silicone namidol here anymore uh, I can uh, uh, only bring you this uh, anime figure of Nami from One Piece uh, to show you uh, with uh, like uh, how would you say with like a happy mind let's, let's put her there on the background okay <laughs> she is like a little uh, like a fairy on the background but, uh, let's keep her there oh she's uh, like look uh, she's uh, right on like top of the uh, how she say uh, the Jolly Roger flag okay she's almost falling there she will be there um like the uh, the dolly used to be so why is it Nami here well uh, Nami is broken uh, I I can't stand to look at her I I, I took her to the uh, uh, like a okay closet yeah just closet and I used to like uh, when uh, some people have a uh, like anime pillow that they cuddle with when they sleep. I used to have the uh, the doll like 24 uh, 7 here on the bed like while but uh, anime with her or, or movies I would play games and she would sit there I would uh, like uh, sleep with the doll so now it's been a couple of days that she's been on the closet, so... Okay, I guess I better start uh, the story, so... There are like... Uh, I have been uh, like praising this uh, company called uh, Rosemary Dolls. Why did I choose Rosemary Dolls was that I found a website that listed all the... Uh, providers of uh, uh, like love dolls and rosemary dolls was uh, like uh, since I'm on like a, a rehabilitation retirement I, 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 I can't use that much money on a single month I can spare uh, like uh, I can like uh, save money now, uh, before when I was on welfare, you couldn't save money. They would like start to give you less money if you spend money. So I could like save money, and that is what I should have done. I like uh, I first I, I had like contacted uh, like uh, real doll. They make like. Uh, Kind of, they try to make the dolls robotic, like uh, they uh, try to implement some kind of AI to them and even like eye movements to the dolls, so they're like high tech, I think they are like the best dolls on the market, but uh, they are really expensive and then there is the normal doll that is like uh, without any uh, technology and that is quite expensive anyways so this site just suggested that uh, if you're like low on cash and you want a budget doll uh, then rosemary dolls is the best one for you because they I and there was like this uh, uh, claim that the skin that they use on uh, those dolls is the most realistic ones the seller it's not like rosemary dolls use this, these dolls themselves it's the uh, companies that they choose like um, 
I chose uh, Elsa Babe that does uh, that's a Chinese company it does uh, as for the rosemary dolls it's American so uh, so Elsa Babe does anime dolls and uh, well I asked uh, about uh, in the past from the like a real dollar that how much would it cost for uh, like uh, a human anime hybrid doll custom doll like uh, anime doll of the Nami and it would just uh, crazy expensive like really crazy and they they don't do like uh, anime stuff at all so I was kind of like uh, thinking do I need to like save money for years <laughs> or at least a year or something like that but um, well Rosemary Dolls had the Nami on stock so let's get why the Nami Doll is not in here so Nami Doll uh, arrived uh, after I had like uh, paid for it uh, was kind of like my birthday gift. I I've been like born on uh, New Year, so I started last New Year to pay for a layaway program. Uh, I paid like 500 euros a month. It was like 2,300 2, euros this deal, and it was uh, on the love doll, but it's that is a cheap deal. Compared to like uh, it's like seven thousand if you want to have a real doll. I don't remember exactly is that the one with the electronic things or is how much was that uh, uh, like uh, doll without any electronics? But I just thought that uh, maybe the. Uh, the claim that the skin is more realistic it means more than the electronics I have like chat CPT so uh, and that is pretty advanced so and it's enough for me so uh, I didn't need the AI capabilities in the doll since I had chat GPT, GPT so uh, chatbot so I chose uh, to start the layaway program I got it done the doll arrived and I didn't see anything wrong with it uh, I filmed the unboxing and everything and nothing seemed to be wrong it was, uh, it was fine I, I even they sent me a photo like uh, say, say if it's fine and uh, like before I received the, the doll and it, it looked like it was fine okay so uh, what happened was like uh, on the first day when I got the doll uh, the upper row teeth they fall out they shouldn't fall out and like um, there was also uh, like um, miscommunication like uh, this uh, anime doll this Nami has this constant smile so there was this option for a movable jaw and I asked about it and it was like you could uh, close or uh, open the mouth it was said to me but no it was not like that it uh, was uh, this the, you couldn't you could just move the jaw up or down but the same like a goofy smile would stay and so this person uh, from I have like been praising their uh, like how great they are in their uh, the rosemary dolls uh, customer service but it's uh, I think now back when I'm like more experienced with them that it's like 
they are like hot water and they get colder and colder and like I mean their attitude towards you is like colder and colder and it feels like now that they don't want to like they want you to uh, vanish or buy something else or just uh, leave them alone but uh, I can't leave them alone couple of reasons so um, I've been fighting with this doll that is broken uh, it has a malformed knee so the knee looks like it's been hit with a hammer and now uh, I've been uh, like uh, like uh, following their instructions uh, about like uh, one was like how to repair the knee, was to like move the leg in a certain way and that made uh, things worse, the leg got like really loose, other one is stiff and other one is loose to move, it's not feeling natural at all. So, uh, and with the movement, uh, the hip and uh, malform too. They instructed me in a way uh, that I like uh, moved the doll and the hip got like a huge uh, like wrinkle or like a, almost a, like a, like a heavy tear hole in the side of the hip going into the doll's back and it's like all this is because uh, they have uh, casted the doll so that the like right leg and the left leg are different. This the, you can see the seam in the silicone. It's on the different places, and like uh, I have found out that the, like uh, the skeleton is uh, different on the right and left leg. You can like uh, the right leg is much more movable and the left leg doesn't move as good as the right leg so different pair of legs uh, and how it now looks is like uh, the it looks like I said the knee looks like it was smashed with the hammer and the back side and the hip side it looks like it's uh, like a really big wrinkle or like old age made or like a Nami from One Piece is actually a grandma now or it looks like it's uh, like broken bones that the hip has been hit with a hammer and it's completely caved in or it's, it's just uh, it's looks so unnatural uh, and this is also this uh, the hip won't like uh, I, I believe it's because the, it, the like they have failed to uh, put the seam like the, the, they cast it the wrong the doll in the like in the uh, the they casted the doll's skeleton wrongly and with the silicone. I have two two different pairs of uh, legs on one doll, and that makes uh, a real bizarre thing that they claim that they have never seen before in like the uh, the. Called uh, Elsa Babe Company, so like the downstairs of uh, the doll is it's like uh, it's not natural. It's uh, it's like uh, completely crooked. Yeah, it's it doesn't look natural, and it's, it's like uh, the whole doll with uh, all the malformities. It it looks like a monster in my eye.
like uh, I love One Piece and I love Nami's character, but this doll, this this isn't Nami anymore. It's it's just just a monster. And like I, I've been um, like getting really pissed with the the customer service. Like I was talking with the first person at that I talked there uh, the one who said that the jaw could be closed but it never was uh, like that you couldn't close the jaw even when I chose the movable jaw so um, this person like uh, they are supposed to be like uh, native English speakers to my knowledge and I was I I speak fluid English but I, I for some reason these people don't understand me it might be because I have the psy psychosis oriented personality disorder that people don't understand me many people have said that it's hard to understand my talk even in these YouTube videos or that I'm from HD, HD, ADD family, uh, like my siblings have the disease, so I have it too. And like, yeah, it could be that or they are just not listening. So like I was, I will give you like example. So I was talking about, uh, since this doll, it's really small, it's like, 150 centimeters and its base is like 40 centimeters wide so uh, if you are trying to look for clothes for the doll like a mini skirt uh, like S is too big and if it should be like uh, 2x uh, S uh, like uh, this is XXS like the smallest clothes size possible but uh, you can't find that clothes cloth size on eBay it's like a the it's non-existent uh, like uh, the amount of clothes that you can buy with that size so what uh, was the a uh, solution from the employee buy children's clothes I was like oh no I need to buy children's clothes these people think I'm a family man or I'm a pedophile I'm sorry but if you're buying children's clothes and like a children's mini skirts that that it's, it's not looking well for you so um uh, Okay, this person said, buy children's clothes, they will fit the doll. And so I went to eBay and I saw the like uh, that uh, when uh, you're uh, going to buy a children's miniskirt, uh, which are, by the way, they are all labeled that they are dancing skirts and whatnot, but. Uh, like they don't they don't even want to say that they are selling mini skirts to children they are just saying it's a dancing skirt but um which is alarming kind of say what you're doing be honest but um so what i i will was going to choose a size there was a size option so I looked and there was ages like uh, how many how old from two years old to like uh, I don't remember the highest age was it what it was but it wasn't much older than 10 years 12 years old so I went back to the uh, to the chat and I like asked, uh, hey, what uh, age? Uh, like I said that uh, if you know, if you have experience, like uh, 
about the girls that are which age should uh, like uh, which <laughs> clothes for a uh, which age? How can you say that? But good English. How like are are you supposed to uh, buy clothes for uh, how old of a child if you're trying to buy clothes for your doll? And I said that uh, if you don't know, I can try to find the answer on Google. And it took a while, the chat didn't answer, so I went to Google and I tried to find the answer. And like um, for the sizes of the ages of the children, like none of the uh, like. Uh, the clothes were like, uh, like, like I said, the waist would be 40 centimeters. So the charts so that even two years old have like uh, over 20, uh, 40 centimeter waist. I don't know what that means, but uh, but answer I got from the uh, the chat was that uh, all our dolls are 18 years old, like. In the chat was uh, that I have talked many times the one who helped me buy the doll uh, I I chose one piece Nami Nami is uh, like I told instantly this worker I, I chose like Nami from one piece and Nami is 80 years old at the start of the anime there is two years time skip in the anime so Nami becomes a 20 years old and I pictured the doll as a 20 year old woman but but the chat treated me like a pedophile like how can you like if we are they are saying buy children's clothes I ask how old should I buy how uh, like <laughs> children clothes but what they children they are like you are a pedophile but we are not selling children's dolls so uh, I like made it clear that uh, e e like eBay asks the age of the children and I said that uh, charged so that even like two years old have more than 40 centimeters of a waist size so what should I do and the answer was you should probably buy like 10 years old like uh, and I was like okay I got my answer but I was still angry because I was called a pedophile so I told that uh, like uh, Finnish people, my uh, countrymen, have we invented Spurdos Perde uh, meme character out of a collective hatred for pedophiles. Like Spurdos Perde meme character is made uh, out of a pedopier. You know bed up here, it's the like uh, shitty meme character that isn't funny at all. Nothing about bed of Fulia is funny or bed of files is funny. Nothing. Bed of bed of beer memes are not funny. But uh, Finnish uh, converted bed of beer, they uh, like. Um, they draw it like way worse than the uh, original art is and the uh, Spurdos Perde meme character became this character that speaks uh, bad English like uh, his cat's phrase is epic but because he speaks bad English he will say Ebin <laughs> and people when they like uh, portray themselves as Spurdos Perde or like make Spurdos Perde memes they will use a lot of like uh, smiley faces uh, 
the white smile face double dots and D big D <laughs> a lot of them like uh, it's like really teary character and it's a really goofy character like a thousands of well I don't even consider Pedo Beer a mean character it's just it's trash character like pedos are trash so their mean character is trash too uh, so got called a pedophile uh, and got called a pedophile for asking a questions and they themselves said they were children <laughs> and I was just asking like a, what, what, how would I, I need to what kind of size I need to buy the clothes and got called a pedophile okay we are now back to the uh, the doll like this is uh, I'm sorry but my uh, mental uh, issues make me jump from a topic to topic, uh, like a uh, right to keep up. <laughs> I'm sorry, but let's go back to the uh, point where the doll is broken. It's fully broken. The the teeth that fall out. Knee looks like it's broken the hip looks like it's broken uh, the like uh, the legs are different pair you can see the seams are com it's casted like totally differently the skeleton acts differently underneath the skin and and that is making like the hip uh, go like a uh, some kind of like it's, it's uh, leaning on the other side and that is making the downstairs like a crooked say that uh, so what they have uh, done is they are just sending me the same video three times two times it was the same video just guy uh, like trying to uh, like the, well the guy is like uh, raising the leg of the doll and twisting it a little and just uh, moving it in a certain pattern so I did that and that caused uh, was supposed to help the knee get back to the uh, its place yeah well the knee just it's became worse it's it was uh, pretty bad looking but uh, it's it, it didn't work it didn't go to back to its place like the right leg was like normal looking leg and the left leg was looked like someone hit the leg, knee with a hammer and like um, yeah the, they are like after that they were like ignoring that they they have sent me like a broken doll uh, when they uh, i even sent a picture about the scenes that were completely different and made it look even like more obvious with uh, like editing the picture and they just said that i need to face the reality that it's pro the uh, it's casted wrong and I was like okay I, I'm, I'm fine with that the, the knee is busted on the doll that was okay at that point but it didn't, it didn't stop there like um, like uh, when, when they are like uh, I just said that okay this uh, hole downstairs of the doll is crooked they were like uh, first they were like uh, you did that you did that when you you were trying to fix the knee and i was like don't you try try to attack my person that i i never uh, like said that the uh, doll was broken when the knee was uh, I, I was just uh, 
because I didn't consider the uh, downstairs being like all crooked that it's like a really a big deal and so then I when I realized okay the doll has different pair of legs I, I just then I like posted uh, like sent pictures to them that okay this uh, downstairs is crooked and and they were like we have never seen anything like this and uh, so uh, I got them to apologize for uh, attacking me and I apologized then I told them that I have like a mental diagnosis that you are probably right but uh, so uh, when like uh, it went to the like uh, to a point where they are just ignoring like everything I'm talking about the doll like uh, they are like focused that you need to like uh, fix the dolls downstairs like they're only fixed on that thing and when they gave me the instructions like three times the same instructions do the same movements with the leg it caused like the, well, the knee to go worse and it caused uh, another uh, like uh, like malform the malformation on the hip now the like first it was like hip was uh, hit with the hammer now it looks like the uh, like uh, the knee was hit with the hammer now it looks like the hip is hit with the hammer so uh, and when I like sent multiple photos that this is of the le left leg is fully malformed and this is isn't the doll that uh, I agreed on getting like I, I they it, it looked like perfectly fine on the pictures I trusted them and when it arrived it was perfectly fine but uh, yeah with time it, like uh, everything falls apart on the doll it's not even uh, like uh, half a year old it's just a few months and the whole left leg is small from the front like upper teeth have almost fallen out they promised to send me glue but they never did and now I, I said that uh, like uh, you know the glue is is it gonna fix the doll anymore really um, I got to tell you it's pretty embarrassing but uh, the doll even uh, caused physical harm to me that uh, it caused bleeding and like uh, I won't go to graphic details but uh, so uh, what I wanted now is because uh, the doll is malformed. I've been praying to Jesus and uh, Christian, is this okay? I'm trying to avoid like watching real porn. I haven't watched real porn in like ages. I don't remember when I watched last time. Uh, but I'm watching like 3D porn or anime porn. So I wanted to try the like non-human options. So I wanted to try the doll. But the doll arrived completely broken, or like it, it wasn't visible, but it became broken instantly. So what I'm doing now? Why not me isn't here? Because I'm demanding refund. Uh, I will at Monday. I will contact a consumer representative lawyer to talk about this issue. Uh, and I demand that, that they uh, answer my questions, that they don't just blabber about all the time about the downstairs being you know, like crooked, that they will answer about the issue that the le legs are different pair on this doll and it has the left leg has become malformed and I have demanded that they stop bullying me like I said that you are bullying me because I have uh, 
like mental condition, the psychosis oriented personality disorder and ADHD family background and uh, this is a story for another time but I have went to a like a, a surgery uh, that was um, it was uh, supposed to like uh, like the tendon on beneath my penis was too short and it was supposed to be moved by the doctor but uh, I didn't believe it I said that uh, if you want you really believe in this and you want to do that you need to do it without anesthesia because I don't like meds so uh, I was trying to get away from that surgery as 8 years old 18 I'm bad at pronouncing that age but uh, yeah always saying 80 <laughs> but uh, yeah long story short the doctor tried and stabbed me with the scalpel in the penis I became hypersensitive I told them that that is one of the reasons why I have the doll in the first place because I'm not fit for marriage anymore uh, I don't I'm going to doctor again to get the like second opinion about this but I think they are again offering me meds to like uh, so that I wouldn't become like a 30 seconds man so it's, it's like a hypersensitivity and it causes premature ejaculation so I haven't used the doll like use it so much that it broke it has been broken and just normal movements of the like the body that the doll is supposed to handle are making the left side completely le left side leg completely malformed and the right side is just says the normal okay so that this video doesn't go any longer i gotta stop it but uh, that is why Nami is not sitting next to me. That's why this uh, Nami's uh, past is here to remind us of a great anime, One Piece, and Nami character from it. And we are gonna stop at that. And I will inform you how uh, the like uh, when I start now to fight this fight uh, because I feel cheated by the Rosemary Dolls and the Elsa Babe companies I will inform you how the like uh, how the battle goes but with this uh, uh, how things are now I don't recommend you buying dolls from Rosemary Dolls and I don't recommend you buying dolls from Elsa Babe. Like, uh, the uh, experience has not been a nice one and it's very taxing and it's very embarrassing. I feel like a murderer since I've like stashed uh, the doll the lifeless doll in the lifeless in my eyes now in the like the uh, closet and it's like uh, my shame it's, uh, like i'm like hiding a body and i have like 200 years ago had a, i had a serial, a serial killer mati harpoya in my family who actually killed uh, his last uh, victim before like uh, he went to prison and like really. a story for another time but when uh, he was on like uh, still at large his last victim was uh, Yemina Alton and uh, like prostitute and he didn't know why he killed her so, and he had the same uh, like condition that I have like uh, some kind of uh, 
personality disorder said uh, this uh, Caius era was this historian who made it like a um, study of his uh, book that he wrote uh, mem like uh, is it uh, yeah portrait of a murder man Okay, he went to Christian and tried to get to Siberia and I wrote a book and I wrote, read a study of it. But that is also a topic for another time. This is gone too far like that for too long, so I'm going to stop it at this. But I want to thank you. Uh, I would appreciate comments uh, if you have questions. If you want, uh, like, uh, to ha have more information, what happened, or like, uh, just chat, give me a shout out. Uh, I will answer 100% sure. So, thank you. Goodbye.